bonus of the Techno Roundry here, and I realized about about a week ago I did a review on Crossy Road. Now I never actually realized that this game would catch my attention. I found myself playing it every day. I played it so much that I actually unlocked a couple characters. To show, I'm gonna show you each of them, except the chicken. There's a chicken. I unlocked the baby duck, giddy goat. I then unlocked. I unlocked a dog. I'm looking for it. I then unlocked Hot Shot. I think I thought I unlocked the Hitchhiker. No, I unlocked Android. I unlocked Andy. I unlocked Dingo. I unlocked Hashtag the Dress. This one's actually pretty cool. I unlocked Butterfly. I unlocked Chimney Sweep. I unlocked Hipster Whale. And I unlocked Drop Bear, which I keep thinking is called a koala. So I'm going to show you each of these in this little episode thing. I'm sorry if you guys heard that on the thing. So let's start with the baby duck. Listen to the noise it makes. I'm just going to raise the volume up a little bit. That's the noise that it makes. It makes it noises. Uh, then we have the giddy goat. And he looks like this. And one thing that I noticed is that each and each character has like their own paste and they aren't their own surroundings. So if I were to choose the Android robot, it would go for the Android lollipop theme. You would see like lollipop and candy, which I'm gonna show to you. So I'm just gonna I also got much better at the game as you guys probably see. Okay, and now let's try Andy out. Actually, no, let's try Hot Shot. I didn't, I didn't realize he was next. So let's check a look at him. Take a look at him. And he seems to have the standard crossy road little, uh, things. The standard crossy road environment. Sorry about that lag. And he died. Yeah. And you hear the, whoa, at the end of it. That's supposed to be people cheering. Then, of course, there's Andy, a.k.a. the android robot. As you can see, if you look around, like, on the tree that I'm sitting right next to, there's sprinkles on it. There's lollipops. As you can see, like, I'm about to go right next to a lollipop. That's a lollipop. So each character has their own environment. And I realize that he's not moving as fast as the goat was moving. Because we just did Giddy Goat. And he's not moving as fast as Giddy Goat was. Or maybe he was. I'm just not seeing it. He's actually my favorite character, uh, Andy is. Now let's check out another one. We now have Dingo, which I think is a dog. And you can see he has his own environment. He has like a deserty environment. Which is really, really cool, I guess. How it actually changes environment like that. Okay. We, there's Dingo, and then there's hashtag the dress. As you can see right now, it's blue. It's blue and black, like how some people thought it was. And as you can see, she's moving incredibly fast. But when she dies and she respawns, the dress is white and gold. I'm on team white and gold, because I, I see white and gold when I look at the dress. I don't see black and blue. Then there's the butterfly, which has a nice animation. And he's in, like, his meadow environment. And he makes, like, a flutter noise. Or she, whatever it is. Okay, that's the butterfly. And as you can see, the environment also changes with the butterfly and with certain characters only. And then there's the chimney sweep. And look at his legs. And he doesn't move as fast. I'm really, really sorry about that lag. It's, it's not trying to. I think other people are using my broadband, that's why. So yeah, anyway, yeah, that's that. And he's not, he's, he's moving at a, a normal pace, I would say. Oh, come on. But as you can see, my top score is 126, so I did make a lot of progress from my previous score, which was 64. And his environment also changes... And then, I think, and then there's Hipster Whale, which I actually unlocked. I got eaten by him. 
And that sounds disgusting. And he takes the picture. He's the guy that you see in the beginning of the show. In the beginning of the game, how that pops up, well, this is him. And he takes the pictures of stuff. And he died, and he sounds like he's splatting stuff all over the floor. Uh, that wasn't supposed to happen. But what, when he falls into the water, since he's a whale, look at that. Game over. That does not make any sense at all. So yeah, so now what we're going to be doing is we're going to be taking a look at Drop Bear. And Drop Bear is a very, very different type of guy. And he lives in, like, the same environment, but he spawns in different stuff, if that makes any sense. So we're going to let him die. And I got to try out the ghost, which is not here anymore. But yeah, I got to try the ghost, and the ghost was awesome, let me tell you that. So anyway, I'm just going to show you a little bit of gameplay. This was not just to show you the characters, this was also to show you that I got much, much better at the game, for those of you who were wondering. Because I did say I might do a part 2 to this, and I might delete it, but I found myself spending a lot of time on this game, so I decided why not. Why not take another look at the game? And I got really good. Like, as you can see, now I'm swiping. And before, I was never swiping. And I... <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna try to beat my score of 126 real quick. So let's do this. This is actually a good map. Generated girl, good world terrain. I mean, I'm already up to 21. Not 25. Crap! Alright, let's try one more time. One last time. Alright, one more time. And... Zoom, zoom. Da -da 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 -da. Ooh, that was so close. Okay. Let's get that. Oh, come on. I, you saw I held the jump. I held the jump. I said one more time. I gotta try yet another time. Swipe, swipe, swipe. Da, 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 Oh, alright. So anyway, yeah, I just wanted to say... Peace out.